Plasma Fission. I'm not getting stung. What? Oh, I thought I was like, how is he gonna lay without stun? Here we go. First blood. No. Second blood. No. They, they, I don't know what level ones people do in solo queue anymore. I just like. AFK at the first minute that I play solo queue. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Got him. The kid is down. I'm not gonna go back to buy. The playing this champion is all about knowing geometry. Pretty much, if you pass that class in high school, you'll be a great Velkaz. And by pass, I mean got an A. I don't know what I got in geometry, so this might be an interesting game. Here we go. Watch this. Okay, so can d definitely tell you I didn't do too well in that class now. Ooh, got the CS and the harass. Maybe I did better than I thought. Oh, oh, oh! What oh my god. This champ is just funny, I don't know. It's a, it's enjoyable. Alright, here, hold up, hold up, hold up. Ooh, I got chunked way too badly there. Alright, I'm taking a lot of free harass from from this champion, or from her champion, so I need to be a little bit careful. She's a little bit out of mana, though. Oh, nope. Unfortunate. So he just cuts through. He tried to do a level 2 gank top? Okay. Cutie got a double kill? Okay. Okay. Oh, whoops, I messed up there. Whoops, that was my bad. I, I was supposed to shoot the Q uh, angled to the bottom here and to get the actual bounce, but I just messed up. Right, like this, like this. Ooh. Was it a jungler again? I didn't even... Oh, it's Eve. Okay, so I'm probably going to die in about a minute and a half. Or actually, just about a minute. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. See, I'm gonna go ahead and max W because apparently that's what the Wolf's Claw does now, and he's like, he only spams Syndra and Belkaz. Okay, so it's okay. Okay. Oh, okay, I missed that. Well, so your what you call it? Your uh, Q costs literally no mana. Which is really good for you, actually. Notice I didn't ward over here because they have an Eve jungle. Oh. I think she's slow. Yeah, she is. Perfect. So I had the flash there because uh, Lulu was had too much move speed. I really didn't want to give him... I, don't know, I just needed the flash there, pretty much. Alright, alright, alright. Man, Crow's really gonna attack me this hard. Alright, whatever. I was already winning in CS by a bit, and then Crumbs just decided to take the whole wave. So, you know what? Whatever, whatever happens. 
Um, so pretty much what I learned playing this champion is that generally you don't ever need um. Well, one I don't need that kind of ward against an Eve. But uh, you don't ever need mana regen because her, his mana costs are actually deceptively low. So as long as you just you just have like a little bit of mana regen, you should be able to use your mana efficiently enough to be able to land. Alright, watch this, watch this, watch this. Alright, don't watch that. Okay. Yeah, I killed Todd, that's good. I actually don't know where mid lane went, which means I should shove. The thing about W Max is you literally clear like the whole wave instantly. Which is really, really nice. Alright, hold on. Well. Okay. Okay. I think Lulu mid is actually pretty bad right now. No! No! Oh, God, I suck. So you see what W... W Max changes the way how you play Belkaz. Whereas before, he, it was kind of hard because you have to depend on angles and stuff with this champion. Now it's just like, you just shove. Okay, okay. I'm pretty sure I can kill her. Oh gosh, she just hit 6. No, I should have all under there. That was my bad. I didn't realize how big of an XP lead I had on her. So right there, if I had all in and hit the E, I would have killed her. Because she has no flash. That's something that I know for sure because I blew her flash. I hit that. Ooh. The angles. I play a little bit of, like more passive because honestly, Eve makes me into like such a bad player. Cause I over I give Eve too much respect. Generally, you should never give Eve like a ton of respect because she's she's annoying, but she's like. If you give her too much respect, you just fall into a trap of never playing aggro. I feel like it's really bad. Okay, well. Uh, the knockup stopped her ulti, so I guess there's no way. Crop just comes in for the turn, I guess. We have to back. Uh, but look at this. Because I W maxed right here. Now it's just like one. Okay, well, that was a bad W, but you, you get my point. Man, Chromes, give me that CS. I think we can just take this turret. Yeah, okay, whatever. And if Eve comes, we just both kill her. It's not a big deal. You just have a free turret. Um, since I have so much ahead of the middle right now, I'm gonna go ahead and pink this side. I should have pinked it probably about four waves ago, but I was I was just really tunnel vision this game. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Free kills, right here. Oh, I thought he was going to go over the wall, but I guess he didn't. So. Ow, ow, please no, please no, please no, please no. The fuck, the pain of that. I, I really like W Max, it's pretty nice. Wait, what the heck, he ulted it? I don't know about that one. That was a little bit excessive. Alright, that's cool. I hit the, the deconstruct on there. So right now, playing Volkaz is pretty much just making sure you get your passive. Your passive does so much damage that you really need to make sure that you get however many passive procs that you can. Oh, I got it. Sick. Is Eve here? Alright, yeah, I had the flash roll too. As soon as she sped herself up and went for that, she's. You have to be able to recognize when the other mid is like. The, a lot of times the other mid just tells you when the jungler is here. Like that stuff right there is like. Well, she's never speed, sped herself up the whole lane, and then she's never walked forward on me when I'm. And I'm two levels up on her, or a level up on her. So, so something like just happened. Like something just came up. So unfortunately, I can't place like four pink words around me. Or else I'd, I'd like to do that, but. Just like I, I'd like for my bot lane to stop dying so much. But unfortunately, good stuff doesn't happen quite that much. It's okay, I can carry my bot lane, no problem. 
Oh boy. Got him. Okay, I need to move, and she's dead. I literally looked over there for once, and I was like, okay, that, that seems like something I should be looking at, and then he died. Okay. See, right now, I see the Eve, which means that there, I know there's a kill chance. God, the Eve's coming back now. Nope, can't go for it now. I have no flash, so I'm probably dead. Uh, oof. I I should have just dodged the hook to be honest, cause then I get a kill Eve. But ooh, does he have this guy? I think he does. Ooh, not bad. The game's kind of close right now, just cause the, our bot lane is like really far behind. Huh. Holy shit. Uh <laughs> Alright. <laughs> yeah, this guy is really I didn't realize it had Hex Tricker and uh Brew. That's a pretty big buy. Alright, so that's a dead Graves. Oh, okay. Then they, they someone replaced the pink for me. So nice. Oh wow, at level 5 I can just one shot the whole wave? So nice. So I max Q second because maxing E doesn't give you that much damage. And I ordered this over because it's just really important for me to be able to see uh, the range for that. I wonder if I can just shoot this. Mm, 223, okay. So they should be careful bot lane because my mid lane is coming bot. Oh boy. Oh boy. I'm all, I am on my way. Oh. Still on my way. Oh my god, I really didn't get that. Okay. Holy shit. Hello, I bury you too. Okay, well, I suck at this champ. My god, that was an easy kill. I thought I'd be able to kill Kiwi Kid like instantly. But I guess the shield save. Does he have any MR? He does not. There's no way he has MR. Yeah. Okay. So now we're actually behind. I think it just looks good because Panth has the kills, but to be honest, Pantheon having the kills means nothing because they have uh, a Rise and like a Graves at 7 and 2. Oh, that suck. I'm actually surprised I died to that. Whatever. Three seconds until I can wave clear this. Let me go ahead and go for blue buff then. And then we have drag pretty soon. Yeah, one, one minute after blue. Ooh, hit. I'm good. So deconstruct only works on the abilities, but it's still so good. It gives you true damage for every time you hit someone with three of your abilities. Huh. There's no way I hit them with that. There's no way I hit her with that either. Isn't that a ward? Oh, well, bot lane looks like it's about to be in some trouble. And she just got exhaust. <laughs> Jesus Christ, that exhaust. Huh, this is actually going to be a really hard fight to turn, I think. Okay. That's okay. 
guys need to be careful because mainly it's just like getting too close is really really bad if you're playing with all cause. It's fine. Let's drag this out. What's my tree damage you hit for right now? 135? That's a lot of damage. What the heck? This is such that's such a bait. Hmm. I don't even need a word over it. Yep, so Kiwi's right behind them here. I have ulti in 25. Hmm, didn't hit him. I should not have used that right there. There's absolutely no way that hits. Okay, okay, kill him. Wait, what the heck? Oh, what the heck? I really missed with that stun. Alright, whatever. Okay. 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 Okay, great. They're all dead. I'm gonna rotate bottom to shove this out real quick. Really, it's just Eve up. Can I take Eve if she finds me? Probably could. Um, I think... I, I don't want, I'm unsure what build to go on this champ. I've heard Haunting is really good, but honestly, I'm not a huge fan of Haunting in general. Unless the, the champion's AP scaling is just absolutely horrible. I want to shove this all the way in so he misses stuff, but I feel like... Okay, 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 no, no, I'm good, I'm good. I'll just back out now. And if Eve catches me here, I'm probably dead. Yeah, I'm probably dead if she catches me. Ah, uh, should be okay, though. Eh, I wasn't able to shove it all the way in. So Kitty still got a lot of farm. But it's okay. Huh. Q does quite a bit. The AP scaling on Q is really good. I think the scaling on the rest of his abilities is just okay, though. Ooh, that's Shunk. Okay. Well, that was literally the, the closest thing I can go. That's She's not getting that one. Sucks, but it's just not happening. We can honestly force a Baron pretty soon. I actually do like his dub, this W Max though. Hmm. I need Leon to be okay. Okay. Nope. The angle needs to be a little bit better. Ooh, she's dead. There's no way. Okay. Where are they running to? Oh, he's checking Baron. Huh. No, he's going top lane to farm? That's pretty risky, actually. I have death cap in 300, 250, something like that. Wave playing super easy with nines. Oh, holy sh. Huh. Alright.
Wow, that was a terrible Leo mode. Okay. He got two? Oh my god, the damage reduction though. Huh. Does he have X Drinker propped? He doesn't? No, this is a kill. Free rise kill right here. Oh, and Rise put himself in like a really bad spot too. Okay, we should just Baron. Go ahead and switch orb. Actually, I'm gonna try the, the blue orb real quick. It did get buffed recently, so maybe, you know, it got a little bit better. Okay, whatever. Guess we can't do it. Fifteen seconds of ulti. The see the ulti ratio is like not that great. I feel like two hundred twenty. Like it's not a one point zero ratio for an ulti. That's pretty underwhelming. But like I I still build AP because the Q ratio is just pretty nuts. It's like the same as my ulti ratio, right? Yeah, but it's a lot more spammable. I want to try to angle it like toward here so that when it explodes it gives me much more coverage you constructed that instantly huh this mid lane is super hard for me to go to see Ki kiwi kid standing really far back what, what that does is that pretty much just means that he can get lantern out at any time in case bad stuff happens so as we have a full cc train on him it's gonna be pretty rough let me go ahead and pink this. What the heck? No, oh, they're not doing it. If he actually got hit there, we could have killed them all. I do a lot of damage right now. I'm gonna actually sit on the wall right here. I didn't want the ulti there because I didn't want to be a Sydney Duck for Eve. That is some. Um, uh... No, there's no way I can reach that. Huh. Oh, you didn't even run forward? Okay, well. That is a very uh, aggressive team right there. He still has flash. Yeah, the way Velkaz, the best way to play Velkaz or with a Vel Velkaz on your team is that you kind of need to kite back. Like, it's really hard for me to get into a fight. I poke and then, like, I have a really good disengage. Because right now, if they didn't chase <laughs> chase that, and we had looked at Force Baron right there, we could have just had them in an easy choke for me to like take them out. I'm rushing Void now. I'm rushing Void. I'm getting Void on my, as my next item. The pain. I need flash. Oh god. Well, as soon as I realized they had my flash, I was like, oh, I'm probably dead. Huh. That was a lot of damage. Okay. Okay, Crumbs is definitely carry the, carrying this game. My Velkaz, not the greatest champion. Crumbs is gonna die here, I think. I just have a. F okay, no, no, no. We're, we're good, we're good. I'm actually surprised how much damage I did to Riser. Does he have no MR? Yeah, he has absolutely no MR. Right, that makes sense. He's right in the blue then. There's no way they can steal. 
I think the only chance that that could happen if there was a ward on, in the pit and rise TP to it. Man, I really think we can just kill this guy. I'm gonna go buy it. No problem. Mila has so much CC that she can just line up for me. I want to back up. I want to back. I want to back. Like, this is really hard for me to do anything into. He is dead. Sucks. I wonder. They pinked it. Yeah, I don't think there's any way this this works. Oh, I accidentally popped that. All right, we should back. This is pretty hard to take right now. I have this res, if he keeps chasing. Huh. I'm wondering if I could have just ultied to kill Q either. I probably could have, but I think he still had his E up. Huh. Oh yeah, there's no way I got that then. This really gets 16. 16 is a pretty big spike for me. Oh my god, this Pantheon has a lot of items. It seems that W has a pretty interesting internal cooldown though. I think it was... I think it's one second or two seconds. Because I was spamming it and I ended up blowing up my... My Q, because I thought it was, I like I thought it would come out immediately. It turns out my Q came out first. I have so much gold right now. It is pretty hard for me to get in on this. And by pretty hard, I mean impossible. I don't understand why we go that far in. Huh. That is definitely not something we want to go into either. Like there, Cutie is the only important person on, the, on that team, pretty much. Yeah, I don't know why we're like trying to dive with this comp. It's super hard for me to get anything. They can't shove in. I'm gonna go back. Oh, we canceled his drop. Okay, and now I can now I can see where we kind of messed up. I'm gonna go ahead and get blue, uh, blue pot. Holy shit! I have so much AP now. How much does this do? And you see, it still doesn't. It's like a point six AP ratio, point five five. Whereas I feel like that's much better on the 4 second cooldown poke. Huh. W doesn't say anything. I'll never get anyone with two parts of W though. It's pretty much just Derev to wave clear, and so I can manipulate the wave easier.
There's no way this is... Oh, uh, well. Yep. No way that'll ever work against Thresh. I really didn't kill him. Holy shit. Huh. I'm surprised he lived there. Man, maybe I just do not do as much damage as I think I do. Yeah, I feel like what we're doing with this team comp and what my champion is, is like pretty counter, like, productive. Oh wow, why? Yeah, just keep it, doesn't go on crumbs, it keeps going on other people. What's a Baron time? One minute. Okay, that's fine. Let me go ahead and get blue buff then. Yeah, I can definitely get blue buff and then... Actually, this might be a little bit risky. Wow, he keeps resetting. Okay. I need to back off now. Huh. He died 20 seconds before Baron. That is really, really bad for us. Okay. That is not good. Oh yeah, they're definitely going. I really don't want to flash in. It's fine. It's back up, it's back up. If he. What the heck? There's no reason to check that. We need wards though. I even the man. Maybe I should have just flashed over Baron Wall. I think that uh, would have been a bad idea, though. Well, he needs a tank. Holy shit! Okay. She cannot start. I need a tank. I need a tank for a little bit. Oh, okay, never mind. She was gonna tank the first initial one. I was a little bit overzealous there then. I think we got this easy. I don't do any damage, please. I, I got it with an auto attack. All right, all right. Here, here. Here's what's gonna happen. No, never mind. She's not going. Huh. W is super good at clearing stuff, though. But the only problem is, it's just not that great at like against other champions. Cause you have to hope that they just suck and walk into it. I can definitely see where this champion does work. It's just super hard to play a champion that actually has kind of poor follow. Like the fact that life form disintegration rate takes five seconds to do its full damage. Like if it did half of its damage, but immediately that'd be better. Just because burst damage in this game is much more valuable, I would say. Especially for like the comp I'm in now. Like if I could just immediately hit them for 700 damage, 600 damage or so, that'd be so much better. Wow, he's ulti the way. Holy shit, all right. We need someone mid though. This is such a bad idea. See, he's going mid. Oh, he needs another person. God. Yeah, I'm on my way back. That was really bad of us. We shouldn't have been bought. Unfortunately, I don't have home guard either. Huh, well. Okay.
And, like, the thing is... God, it's so hard for us to push forward with this champion. I don't, like... Oh, it's... They really need a kite back. Oh my god. Well, he still had flash at the end, and that boost he was insane. It's really, really hard for me to reach them. This actually might be game. No, 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 they can only get one. He should not go in on this. Oh, ho holy shit, that goes through? That's pretty unreal. He's gonna get a triple kill, holy shit. All right, crumbs. <coughs> I think Rallys is pretty useless, to be honest. I just don't know what else to get. It'd probably be something along the side lines of a Banshees, but I think that's pretty unnecessary. I'll just buy one anyways. Yeah, there's no way we can end. Like we might, we can get the end hit for sure. And the rest of the stuff is like up in the air. What's my ulti cooldown? 68 seconds. Please don't hit me. I didn't even reach all the way. Okay. Back off. This is so so bad. I'm just gonna go ahead and get blue buff. Oh, should we back door? Hmm. A little bit questionable whether or not we can do this. I mean, we could definitely 5 stack for this. I just don't think we're going to get anything. Yeah, we're not. Go for my blue buff. Enormous wave bot. I think we're going to lose a turret. Actually, no, no, no. Panty has to get to it. That's really good. I feel like as long as this champion can keep kiting, it's really hard to push in on Belkaz. Just because he's got so much annoying stuff. His cooldowns are so low, he just keeps spamming stuff at you until you get mad. And you try to brute force your way in, and then you just die. So I'm gonna go pick up a blue pot now. I'm CDR capped, and I have a cow. Huh. Did she ulti? Like, I don't know if she if she did an ulti, I need to be more careful. I was scared of something being in there. Like, I pretty much... Yeah. We can just push in top, it's not a bit... Especially with the amount of poke that we have. Please don't tell me she used something. Like, Sivir ult. Oh my god, why would you Sivir ulti? Like, we don't have good kiting tools now that Sivir ulti is gone. Yeah, we can just get this hurt though. I need to angle a little bit more. The cover is more range if you angle into the wall, for instance. Like that. Like, like those are the ones that are harder to dodge. Yeah, not a big deal, okay. 
What's the time on this? 40, 41. Okay, we can rush. We can definitely rush. Good. So why does zone outrise? Huh. They're kiting so far. It's coming up in 10 seconds. Yeah, that's why I, yeah, pushing that far in when the inhibs coming up. No one no one saw the timer on the inhib. It was so stupid. Oh, we just go ahead and get dragged. I get my banshees and we are okay. I'm not using my E correctly this game. Like, I'm definitely holding on to it too long. The range is surprisingly low, but it has to be because it's like a it's his like AOE CC. The heck? Okay. Sorry, let's just go back and defend this. I don't know if he can, to be honest. I don't want to die. I'm just gonna, this is why Banshees is so important for me right here. Alright, no Lulu, we can fight. I think so as well. I just staggered an auto there. Does she have it? Oh, she has it. Holy shit. If she has flash, <coughs> that's a free kill. Oh, this has been an interesting game. <laughs> 